Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I made a video, but I'm glad to be making this video. It is currently, I'm making this video, it is March 19th. And um, if you haven't heard, coronavirus has taken over the world. I'm sure you have heard. I wanted to make a video today and just do like a what I eat in a day uh, because pretty much I'm spending way more time at home than I usually do and I figure this is a perfect opportunity to just make another video and show you guys what I eat in a day. Um, so with that, I'm gonna get started. So as you guys know, I always start my day with lemon water. I actually already drank my lemon water. This was it. And now I'm going to make some celery juice. And I wanted to share, I got this new juicer. Um, it's from Amazon and it's actually like, I don't know if you can tell, sorry about that. Um, but I don't know if you can tell, but it's tiny. It's very compact and um, it's a vertical masticating juicer by Tech Wellness. And I'm gonna try it out and let you guys know what I think. I'm gonna get started with my celery juice and make that and um, yeah, get my day going. So overall, I ended up really liking using this Tech juicer. Um, I had to double strain it, but otherwise it was really great. Um, the pulp was really dry and it yielded a lot of juice so I would definitely recommend it if you guys are looking at getting one it's very inexpensive and you can find it on Amazon celery juice. I had breakfast which was half of a papaya, one cup of wild blueberries, and some date syrup drizzled on top. And with that I had some raspberry leaf and nettle leaf tea. About an hour later, I had some lemon and honey water. If you're someone who has a hard time drinking water because you just don't like the taste of water, then I highly recommend putting some lemon and some honey into the water and it just, it honestly, it makes it taste so good. It makes it taste like a healthy lemonade and um, by putting the lemon and the honey in it, it just makes it more absorbable and um, really hydrates your body more because the lime has special mineral salts in it that help draw the hydration and the water into the cells. So I'm going to drink the rest of this and you know, if you guys have never tried it, you should definitely give it a shot. I'm sure some of you have. Um, but if you haven't, like I said, give it a shot. I think you'll like it. Oh yeah, and I just thought I would mention too that I try to drink about three of these a day. Sometimes I can drink four of them. It just really depends on how high, how much, it really depends on how much hydration I need. Um, but each of these is about 30, 32 ounces. So I end up drinking anywhere from like 90 to 120 ounces of water a day. Um, and like I said, this tastes so good that it's really just like so easy to drink it. Um, so yeah, gonna go back and finish up some work and then 
we'll see what the rest of the day brings. Okay, so my lunch is gonna seem really strange to some of you guys, but basically what it was was spirulina, barley grass juice powder, and chaga powder. Uh, mixed with some maple syrup and water to make a paste and then what I like to do is I like to dip bananas and Vegetables today. I chose cucumber into it and um, That's what I like to eat. Yeah, I know not all of you will think that that sounds good, but yeah I just like to eat weird things and so that's what I eat this day. Oh yeah, and I'll also add the reason that I like to have vegetables with this is because by adding a vegetable to your fruit meals, it helps to slow down the rise in blood sugar and it also helps to stabilize it and keep your blood sugar uh, stable for longer. Yeah. 